With the release of the Desert Kingdom's culture pack for Total War Rome 2, we've had a lot of comments on the tough starts that some of the factions have. So, we thought we'd try and figure out which of the faction starts in Rome 2 are the absolute toughest to handle. Without further ado, here's what we think are the hardest starts in Total War Rome 2. Number 5. Starting at the bottom of the list, it's one of the big hitters of the Grand Campaign, Carthage. More specifically, the Barsid Dynasty. Being such a major power, it's definitely possible for Carthage to snowball into a wrecking ball in the Grand Campaign. But playing as the Barsid Dynasty lacks the diplomatic and public order benefits of their siblings. With multiple fronts to fight on, most of your land divided into client states, and multiple high profile enemies just waiting to kick off wars with you, it can be a tricky start for an inexperienced player. Number 4. Moving up in difficulty, we look at the new kid on the block, Masayasli. With a penalty to their research rate, this Desert Kingdom faction will struggle to keep up with the rest of the world, and most of their benefits are tied to desert battles, which means they'll be at a disadvantage when dealing with the outer world. The biggest problem they'll have early on in their campaign is the Carthaginian hold on North Africa, a very powerful enemy with a strong grip on all of their surrounding territory means that Masayasli will really struggle to expand. Number 3. The Odrysian Kingdom of the Balkan Tribes has some real threats to contend with, with Macedon and the Greek states vying for their blood and no real friends to speak of. Once the Odrysians get rolling, they're not the most difficult factor to play as, but their start is very hard to get out of alive, with no obvious ways to stave off the Hellenic threats and some major gaps in their unit roster. Number 2. As part of the nomadic tribes culture, the Masagete are definitely up there as one of the hardest campaigns in Rome 2. With a roster consisting almost entirely of cavalry and horse-mounted skirmishes, Masagetean armies suffer greatly in siege battles. They also have a terrible starting economy and have real difficulty dealing with the other nomadic tribes that they start their campaign next to. And finally, number 1. For the hardest start in the game, for all the true masochists out there, we have to look at the free Imperator Augustus campaign. The Marco Manni are without a doubt one of, if not the hardest faction in the game. Starting very poor with a bad capital city, weak early game units and multiple threats to deal with. Marco Manni's neighbours are bigger, more powerful, unanimously hostile and one of them just happens to be the Colossus that is Octavian's Rome. This campaign is not for the faint hearted and playing on Legendary will fell even the most experienced Total War players. Thanks for watching! If it's been a while since you've played, we've massively updated Rome 2 with free content and patches over the past few months, so make sure to check it out. And let us know in the comments what you think is the hardest Total War campaign of all time.